In this video, I'll demonstrate how to create a new trigger. Triggers are used to alert people and external systems to events that occur inside ConnectWise Control. To create a trigger, navigate to the Administration page and select Triggers. Click Create Trigger to open the dialog. First, enter a name for your trigger. I'll create a trigger that sends an email when a host connects to an access session. I'll name it Notify when host connects to access session. Next, you'll define an event filter and an action. A trigger follows the if-then model, the if being the session event, the then being the action. To add an event filter, type it in the box or click the plus button. Select a filter to add to the text box. You can enter multiple conditions to add more detail to the filter. I'll select event event type equals connected and connection dot process type equals host and session dot session type equals access. For a complete list of available properties, click the Show Reference link. Next, add an action. There are three actions to choose from. Send email automatically. Sends an email when the event conditions are met. Perform web request automatically performs an HTTP method when its conditions are met. Add session event will create a session event when a condition is met. I'll select send email and specify the content. Then click save. Now when a host joins an access session, an email will be sent to me. To see more trigger examples and learn more about triggers, be sure to visit our documentation at connectwise.com slash control docs. Thanks.